we are going to look at how you can recharge this binance app without actually getting it from mobile money direct we are going to use our binance account and put it money or put money on binance without having to use mobile money why are we going with this method because as everyone knows the government of this country suspended mobile money transactions with cryptocurrency the interaction of mobile money with cryptocurrency for reasons that i gave in my telegram group so if you don't you have not joined my telegram group the link is in the description below make sure you join my telegram group so that you get updated with everything that is happening like this so in this video we are going to look at how we can transfer money to this binance app without having to use the suspended way or the mobile money way so this is how my home page is if you are not seeing this then you will come and click on wallet you come and click on home this is my home binance app when you click on home there is this app up here uh, you come home let me first come if you are not seeing this we are going to use the peer-to-peer -peer method we are going to use the peer-to-peer -peer method if you are not seeing this peer-to-peer -peer method this peer-to-peer -peer method right this peer-to-peer -peer trading if you are not seeing it then you are supposed to come over here this when you because definitely when you open up a new account you will not see it by default you will come up here and you click on it when you click up here and it opens you see this is how it will be looking now here you will be seeing everything that you are supposed to do but this is where you should come if you are not yet seen peer to peer it will be showing that you are in just you are in light by now so you will click here to make because before you click it will be like this this is how it will appear the light by now this is how it appears this is the home page for the light by now but now you are not seeing peer to peer method the method that you want to see so if your account is a new account this is how it will look like but because but if you want it to you want the peer to peer method to come or peer to peer trading to come what you will do you will come to this upper button here where we were you click on it after clicking on it you will see that the binance light will be here just click on this button here when you click on it then binance will automatically transform to binance pro and this is how binance pro looks like so if you don't if you again you don't see if you don't see this peer-to-peer -peer trade here then what you should do you come to more you come to more here where there is more you click on it you click on more when you click on more this will open then you'll scroll through you'll scroll through all this you'll scroll through when you scroll you will have to get to trade you get to trade and in trade you will see something like peer-to-peer -peer. so we are going to be using peer-to-peer -to, -peer to recharge binance and after recharging binance automatically we would be able to recharge bitbank and we are going to talk about bitbank a little bit later but let's see how we can recharge binance now members if you want to recharge binance all you have the first thing to do is to come to peer-to-peer -to -peer. when you click on peer-to-peer -peer, automatically when you click on you will find usdt you'll find bitcoin usdt we are going to use the usdt because that's what is most common and that's what you can bring in well, now we are going to when you click here you are going to see up here when you click you will see up here that buy buy but beside buy you will see something like sell now this this peer-to-peer -peer will help you to transfer your money either from a binance account or to a binance account now if you want to put to buy usdt to put usdt onto a binance account this is what you are going to use you are going to buy usdt so that that usdt can come to your binance account now how are you exactly going to do that you see these are the following traders that we have these are the following people that are trading the merchants of binance on peer-to-peer -peer trade you can find them there are very many there are very many even you by the way you can be one of them you apply to binance and they can add you here so when you see people who applied and they approved these are the people who are currently working for today tomorrow you might find other people but now what you see if you're going to buy the first thing you you have to see is to check that how much crypto amount is this person having in his wallet now this crypto amount is locked that this person cannot maybe cheat you because already this amount of money this crypto the amount amount locked can also vary the on different traders but that one can help you to know that this person cannot maybe steal your ten dollars because now if he steals his ten, your ten dollars is going to be locked he has 90 dollars in his account 90 usdt 
so you easily transact with that person now you find the rate now this person is buying at uh is buying at three thousand is buying at three thousand let me see you click on peer to peer peer to peer yes let's open again now this person is buying the first person is buying at three thousand uh, 733 the second one is buying at 3735 the third one is at three so you'll walk through and the factors to consider here one is the crypto amount then two is the limit because these different traders will have their own limit someone says for me i have this amount of capital therefore i'll be trading between this and this so you may want a million when this person cannot trade a million like here like the one I'm seeing this trader here for him is saying that his limit is from twenty thousand to three hundred and uh three hundred and forty seven maybe his capital is maybe one hundred or two hundred u s d t so this is the limit therefore if according to what you want you'll always have someone to serve your interest then the third the third factor to consider is the mode of payment that how are you going to pay this person like you see for example this first one you are seeing that this person is the mode of payment is only empty and mobile money therefore the only way you're going to pay this person you're going to buy his usdt through paying him through empty and mobile money how are you going to pay the second one the second one is saying that you can pay him through airtel money you can pay him through empty and mobile money you can pay him through cheaper cash then the third one is saying you can pay him through MTN, through Airtel, through cheaper card. So you will choose which one, uh, depending on those three factors, members. First check on those three factors. And then the fourth one, the fourth factor you should check on, how many times has this person done trades? And uh, what is the percentage of accuracy of this person? Now you see, like the first one has done 522 trades since he was joined by NAS peer-to-peer. And he's having a 98% percent 98 percent accuracy like he has been this 522 trades he has been doing accurately now the second one is having like a four 243 uh, trades and uh, the accuracy is 96 so members those are the four things you should consider you should also consider the number of trades someone has done the number of trades someone has done is also very important and uh, like you can see this person here has done 1000 this one has done 1,390. This one here, I'm seeing this one has done 1,390 trades. Hmm? This one over here, 1,393 trades. And this person is having a 99%, 99.79% accuracy. Yes, this is Bravo UG. And you can see that his capital is not all that big. His capital is small. He accepts MTN and Airtel. And uh, you find that... Uh, if, this is a very big business opportunity to all Ugandans because if they suspended empty mobile money, we should not always be negative. We should be positive. We should look at things that business. There's always a business idea. Every time we have you have a problem, every time you identify a problem, there's always a solution, and that solution could be a business idea. So these are the members who at least picked up to solve that problem. You too can do it. You just come to Binance. You apply. And maybe if you want me to show you how to apply that, to apply to become a merchant, I will do that. So if you really have time and you're online, it doesn't need a lot of capital. You just take your money and you take your range and you'll be making money on Binance. So today we are seeing how you can buy basically. Now, for example, if I chose, I, I, I liked this one. I liked, uh, I liked this one who was offering, who was having 1000 1000 yes this one here I'll, I'll, maybe if i've chosen this one why have i chosen maybe this one because i feel like here he has done 1239 and i'm seeing by me his capital is not all that big uh no she's not the one uh, there's someone who is having a small capital that i want to use yes this one here this one who has not done any he has not done any trade i think he's this he has not done any trade Mm, is this one here yes this one he has done 1000 1394 trades that is the 99 percent and uh, he, he's only having 40, 59 usdt locked so what we are going to do i'm going to use this one if i've chosen this i told you that you take your time to choose which one you're going to use so i'm going to buy you click on you click on buy you click here this is the buy when you click on buy it will open 
now this is the interface that will open now you want to buy usdt of how much assuming you want to buy usdt of maybe one hundred thousand, make sure you you double check the range of the person you're buying from maybe i want to buy uh fifty thousand fifty thousand for right now me i don't want to buy but just for the sake of the video i want to show you the steps so when you write the amount there it will show you the quality or how much how many usdt are you, is that estimated to obviously it will show you that okay when you are going to buy for fifty thousand we're going to give you 13.38 usdt so if you really accept that you come and click on if you accept that you click here you click on buy with zero fee ladies and gentlemen peer to peer is zero fee there is no extra money charged so when you click on buy you click on buy and when you click on buy this is what is going to happen this very person you have chosen to trade with is going to appear here the binance holding sellers crypto everything about the information about this person is going to appear then the amount you are willing to to pay for it then every they are, they are giving you payment options here down here you will be seeing payment options i'm going to buy it from mtn i'm going to buy it with airtel so you have the payment options then here you have uh how to make payment you can click on how to make payment you learn you learn how to make payment they have there are some terms and conditions you have to first make payment and we are going to see step by step of that so here you come and make payment you click on make payment and when you click on make payment you have options they will give you options of making payment like here this person has listed has listed these are the options so you take the name you take the number and you send money to this person so you when you click and you send money to this person this is now after sending money at this point you are supposed to send money Mem members this money is not sent through binance you get your mtn if you have chosen mtn you send to this very person this very number on this name at this moment you when you send it you have to click you you click you save the message or the receipt of sending if you use the bank then when you come and see you will you come and check down here down here you have transfer notify the seller transferred notify the seller you're going to notify the seller that you have already transferred the amount of money so members peer to peer terms and conditions says you should not click this transfer notify seller transferred notify seller when you have not yet sent money because when you click on this then the, the seller has to send for you that usdt since i've not sent any money i was just showing you i'm not going to click on it but if i've already if i had sent money i was supposed to click on this and my money will be sent in the usdt so it is as simple now that we have explained for you the way you can withdraw money and uh, the way you can deposit your money on your bit bank account for example here right over here i have around 141 us dollar so you have known how to bring this money right over here so what we are going to do right now is actually how you can put remove this money from binance to bitbank now removing for bitbank you have quite a number of options but the best option that we use is transferring through transferring through a tron network that we have very many videos on this channel that has been talking about that all you do if you're going to transfer through the tron tron 20 network you just come and click on spots when you click on spot you are going to click on deposit you are going to deposit you are going to click on withdraw rather because you are withdrawing from binance you click on withdraw so you withdraw from here you click on withdraw of course you're going to control you are going to use usdt usd usdt then you come and choose tron network so when you choose tron network you put in the address which address now you go and copy the wallet you are sending to and in this case you are sending it to bitbank so you come to bitbank and you make sure you choose the wallet of bitbank you go and get it click on wallet you'll be able to see this recharge but here on bitbank click on the recharge when you click on recharge it will open for you this now you have options for the for recharging bitbank option is of course first copying this when you copy this you come and paste here when you copy it you paste here and then you'll be able to select the network to be a tron network because we are using a tron network trc20 then you will choose the amount you're transferring then you'll be able to withdraw from me and it will go to 
to bitbank i just wanted to show you an overview if you don't know this step very well we have another video on this very channel where we move through you the steps that you can use to transfer that money so uh, what i also want to tell, tell you that that's not the only way you can deposit money on bitbank we have other ways you can connect your binance account to your bitbank account you can see you can also use the moon pay if you have your country is registered under moon pay you come and check on moon pay you see how you can transfer money to bitbank using moon pay so this has been the latest update that bitbank make to their app if you know that you don't have this binance connection or moon pay just go to play store and make sure you upgrade your app because the app has been updated the app has been updated so make sure you update your app so there are some people who don't feel comfortable with their uh, transacting the other peer-to-peer merchants of binance and they feel like transacting someone who knows you can con to contact me you have my whatsapp number uh, you can pick it on the youtube channel you can contact me and we talk about if i have what you want because sometimes you may be in need of in need of usdt when i have them or you may be in need of cash when i have it and we talk on the price of that and then i'll be able to transact with you like this for example this one here was not comfortable with the peer-to-peer -peer method on binance and contacted me and we did this transaction he wanted to sell for me 10 usdt and he sold for me this is how this is a, a proof of everything that we did he sent for me usdt then i sent for him uh, his cash so you may be in need of usdt or you may be in need of uh, cashing out your money so if i have that i'll always uh, i'll help you and uh, if you, in case you you, you are not comfortable just check on the peer-to-peer -peer method and you make sure you recharge your binance account ladies and gentlemen make sure you subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification button if you are someone who likes making money online who like uh, using money making apps and who likes investing online we are here to serve you turn on the notification button because more of such is loading thank you so much see you in the next video